With the semester in full swing and two weeks of autumn in the books, we here at Cal TV thought it was the best time to take a look back at some of this summer's biggest moments in entertainment and media. I'm Ashwin Ramesh, and this is Music Movies Mayhem Summer 19 in America. This summer saw a ton of new music releases, ranging from pop icons like Taylor Swift, Miley Cyrus and Ed Sheeran, to younger artists on the rise like Lil Nas X and Claro. The hip hop world in particular was a whirlwind, largely thanks to the aforementioned Old Town Road songwriter's success on the charts and the stirring of the debate about what actually can be considered rap. Artists like DaBaby and Lizzo blew up, while Megan Thee Stallion had the entire Twitterverse obsessed with having a hot girl summer. Other major highlights included Shawn Mendes and Camila Cabello's collaboration, Senorita, the Jonas Brothers' return to the musical charts, as well as legends like Madonna, Bruce Springsteen, and even Nas dropping projects. Now, for what it's worth, some of my favorites that may have flown under your radar include British artist Skepta's Ignorance is Bliss, Atlanta rapper Lil Keith's Long Live Mexico project, and Steve Lacey's debut album, Apollo 21. And let's not forget the front-to-back slap fest that is so much fun by none other than Young Thug. Moving on to the television that dominated this summer. In the world of TV, it was all Game of Thrones, Euphoria, and Tyler C. The final season of Game of Thrones had fans buzzing, until it became Zendaya time, of course. Euphoria, the new HBO hit series executive produced by Drake, received considerable acclaim for highlighting the struggles that teens face every day. Netflix, not to be outdone, also had a massive release, When They See Us, a four-part series from Ava DuVernay highlighting the Central Park Five case that shocked the world. And now for the summer of cinema. This summer we saw a reimagined Men in Black, a live action Lion King, more Tom Holland Spider-Man, and yet another three hour special from Quentin Tarantino. The director's latest film, Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, has a star studded cast with Brad Pitt, Leonardo DiCaprio, and Margot Robbie, just to name a few. Other box office hits this summer included franchise favorites like Toy Story 4 and It Chapter 2. And for those of you into more independent cinema, some gems to check out are The Last Black Man in San Francisco and American Woman starring Sienna Miller. This summer was something truly special. But even outside of music, movies, and TV, there was a ton going on in pop culture, from the famously overcrowded Democratic debates to the spectacles that were the NFL and NBA offseason. But now we must turn our focus to the last quarter of the year, with plenty of exciting content bound to be released. With CalTV Entertainment, I'm Ashwin Ramesh.